What's up guys? Thanks for clicking. Uh, in this video, um, I'm back at the skate park. I'm not gonna make everybody at the skate park, guys. Just gotta try and get a bit of practice in so I can actually drive around the skate park for future reference before the weather turns too bad. Uh, and this one, I've bought out the Outcast 4S. Um, it's a stunt truck. It says it's a stunt truck on its Google description and Alex box. So surely this should be the one that can handle the skate park. Let's find out. <laughs> Okay guys, well this is it. So um, I've done three cars in the skate park now. Broke two so they wouldn't continue. One was okay. Funny enough, the one that was okay was the cheapest one. Um, quick disclaimer before we do this. Uh, after the big rock experience with the uh, exploding diff, I tried to uh, adjust the slipper clutch on this. The slipper clutch, someone's locked tight, it's solid. So this might be a really quick video because um, this, I don't know whether it's locked up tight or locked up loose, I've got no idea. I'm not really clear enough to know if it's slipping or not. Perhaps one of you can tell me from the running video, unless of course the diff explodes or something goes bang very quickly, in which case we'll know, won't we? Uh, but anyway, let's stop talking, let's start driving. So in theory, guys, this is a 3S, but it's, I mean, it's a, it's a 3S chassis with bigger wheels, really. Um, but it's a stunt truck, so surely it should be good at this. Ah, oh, jeez. We want to see if it can backflip, don't we? Let's be honest here. Yes, it can. Now I've made the tires nice and wet from the grass. Ooh. That fence is a little bit of an awkward place. I think we got that. I don't really want to go quite as high. Or, I want to go really high.
Eat your heart out, Traxxas. <laughs> Oh no, we knocked the battery out, I think. Yeah, just knocked the battery out. No, that was cool, but I missed it on camera. Shame. Grind.
Right, so there we go. Can you take a car to a skate park as a noob and come away with it not broken? Yes, you can. But unfortunately, it's got to be a decent car. <laughs> so yeah, this Outcast 4S, um, I love this car, guys. Armour, if you have, well, Armour, are you listening? Because <laughs> they're listening to me, I don't know. If anyone talks to Armour, tell them to bring this 4S range back. It's brilliant. I think the best the bigger wheels or the bigger shock absorbers, I don't know what it is. But this car's awesome. You can see there, I did some crazy stuff. I landed it really badly, uh, plenty of times. And it's not broke though. Look, nothing is broken on it. Nothing at all. It's all good. There's nothing broke. I landed it upside down the roof a few times. We scraped down these, scrape these screws, which is what they're designed for. But other than that, you know, we're jumping up here, we're jumping up there. We're jumping everywhere. So that's it guys, thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to, if you can find one and you want to buy a car that's a good beginner car, quite cheap, I think I paid 300 pounds for that off eBay, second hand. I think they were only about 400 pound new, if you can find the new one still, but um, I had a quick look this morning, I couldn't find any new ones, so you might be regard, um, you might be stuck with eBay. But if you can get hold of one guys, it's a cracking car. Um, and you can pretty much bash it and it'll just come back for more. It loves it. That's only on 3S. I've got a 4S battery now, so we'll, uh, next one we'll give it a 4S run. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. My name's Ben. This is Noob RC. I'll see you in the next one.